right. Uh, I looked at the uh, forecast. Seen seventy uh, percent or so of high cloud, uh, and there was also the fog was up to like thirty. Uh, this is the app clear outside, and uh, haven't seen fog that high on the app before. So it was either I'm going to get foggy pictures, or I'm going to have a really nice sunrise and looks like it's going to be more fog I've hit some pretty uh, thick patches on the way in <clears throat> uh, I'll point you toward the uh, what I was going to do for the sunrise and uh, we'll discuss it over there uh, back that way there's an opening uh, with the tree I found uh, had to be uh, two years ago uh, I took a picture of it with my digital uh, not the greatest not the best conditions just wanted to you know kind of document it it there's look like there's plenty of fog in that field uh, that was one of the things I wanted to come back and shoot that tree the only problem is uh, motorcycles run rampant back here and uh, destroy things uh, one uh, like a year after I shot that tree uh, they had just ran through the whole field and actually ran over one of the little trees that was part of my composition don't know if it sprang back or if it's still in the uh, or if they went through again and ruined it uh, the area has like real high grass and uh, the composition which I tell you when I saw it just reminded me the guardian uh, it was one big pine tree uh, tall grass and two little pine trees, one on either side, kind of like, you know, somebody standing there with their arms around, you know, two little shoulders. So, we'll take a look at that, uh, especially with this fog. Uh, I may take two pictures here. Uh, I think it'll look interesting. Uh, knocking out, there's a lot of trees that just, you know, don't look that great. Yeah, they're dead, or they're pine trees, which aren't very exciting. So, uh, I'll show you a quick peek over there, and then we'll walk over. Alright, uh, it's still pretty dark. Uh, a little bit before sunset. Uh, I don't know if this is gonna. Uh, if there's gonna be enough fog. Uh, I was here in the winter time. I set up in there. Uh, I think there's a picture on my Instagram somewhere. Uh, I had the digital. Took a picture of the back of the digital camera. And the snow was heavy enough that really separated the curve of the uh, stream it kind of runs through here so I'm just gonna peek around see if I see any compositions don't know if I want to fight my way through that brush all the lily pads in there right now. I'll take a peek at it. Uh, you can get a better, better line up of the stream. Here it dove. Frogs. All right, let me poke around and uh, see if I anything worth shooting uh, I do have that one tree I was telling you about 
and another the uh, cedar swamp that was uh, in one of my Pineland series videos. Uh, I think that would look nice with uh, fog separation because those cedar trees are just nice and straight, no branches. So I was going to check that out too. All right. Uh, do I get the camera set up? All right, uh, I didn't feel there was anything at the water. Here's the tree. Uh, a little tree on the left side is uh, a little smaller than it used to be. I think I'm gonna take a picture. I'm here, it's foggy. And uh, see what I get. grass really isn't as tall as it normally is. I have to see what looks better. Got these two little taller ones that are kind of shaped in. The sky is actually uh, doing something but it's not going to look right with all the fog so we'll stick with fog pictures. All right, uh, let me walk around a little bit and then get the camera set up. Alright, before I lose my uh, fog back there, uh, metered four seconds, Let me meter again. <clears throat> I'm gonna, uh, still four seconds. I think I'm gonna go two stops uh, to brighten the tree. Two stops extra. Poor trick can handle it. Dark slides out. One picture done. Fog's definitely not hanging in there. All right, let's pack up and uh, see if we can find something else. I always thought this would be a good spot for owls, being nice field, tree to sit in. 
never really hear any back here. Guess what I found? It's amazing where these things end up. We will clean that one up. Oh, and the little flies are out. Forgot about that time of year. Uh, they're about, I guess, as annoying as as midges. Uh, it's just these little flies, but little round the tips of their wings are round and they just swarm you all right I think I'm almost to the spot I wanted to check out wait for me to get out All right, depends how bad the uh, flies are, which seems like they're going to be pretty bad. Well, there is some fog here. Yeah, these things are like relentless. Uh, maybe I can spray. I can't remember if they bite. You know, they just keep swarming you and the more you swing at them I think they call their buddies All right, there's early. it's a little cool spot but I never find anything to take a picture of can't really get get at the water A nice little uh, uh, falls. All right. Yeah, they may be too. Uh, Too wicked for a fight for a picture that I really don't see anything. I'm kind of forcing. 